Hi everyone, welcome to Fitness Friday. It is time to work out. Um, I hope you all have had a good week. It is my second video of the year. I'm hoping to do a video every week, once a week. Um, I'm here sometimes Wednesday, sometimes Friday, sometimes whenever I can fit it in. So, I'm glad you're here. If you're here and you wanna work out with me, say hi, I'm ready. Um, or if you're like, I will do this later. Uh, let me know. I'd love to know who's working out with me and um, yeah, who's who's killing it with their goals for the new year too. So this workout is going to be 30 minutes long. I've taken a couple polls and um, a lot of people have said that they like their workouts under 30 minutes. So we're going to do just this 30 minute workout. It's going to be um, weights. Uh, you're going to need a variety of weights today, like medium weights and then light weights. Um, if you have resistance bands, you can use those. Um, if you have a ball... Whoops, don't know my orientation. The ball is right there. If you have a yoga ball, get that. If you have a step, bing, use that. Um, I'm also using a yoga mat. Um, so it's gonna be a variety of um, equipment. I could not think of that word. Uh, so yeah, variety of equipment today. Um, we're gonna change it up a little bit. So it's gonna be the strength portion is going to be all upper body. And then the cardio portion will be focused on lower body. So we're gonna work everything. Um, and we're gonna get those big fat burning muscles in the legs uh, pumping on cardio. So I hope you can join me. Let me know if you're here, if you're working out with me. And um, let's get started, I guess. It's gonna be 50 seconds on with a 10 second rest. We're gonna do 30 um, rounds. and 30 rounds, 30 sets, 30, I don't know. Anyway, it's gonna be 30 minutes long. Um, what else was I gonna say? If you live in the Portage, Kalamazoo area and want to work out with me, let me know and we can make something happen. So, are you ready to do this? I am currently fasting. I'm doing an intermittent fast. So, I'm going on, I'm doing this on just coffee and water. So, we'll see. We'll see how this goes. All right, you ready? Okay, I've been on my knees that whole time, so now i got to shake out the cobwebs. All right, so I have a little bit of a different setup today. My orientation is a little strange. I've also got Kleenexes because it's Michigan and Michigan um, we have sinus infections from I would say January to December so it's pretty great you should move here. All right got my last water we're gonna start with warm-ups. I'm not wearing my weighted vest yet I might put it on gotta pull up my underwear and my leggings. All right you guys ready for this? I got my towel in case I get sweaty which I know I will Okay, um, the, I, uh, I wrote the workout on the write-up. So if you have any questions, consult that. Um, yeah, again, share this with someone you wanna work out with. I'm directly under the light and I realize that's causing a problem. So that's great. <laughs> uh, anyway, let's get started. We're gonna start with warm-up jumping jacks. Let me move this, I feel like this will be a good spot to do that. All right, what if we add a little extra resistance and put on our booby bands? Kick, 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 kick. Who wants a nice butt? I want a nice butt. All right, I'm gonna put resistance band around my thighs so that when I'm jumping out, I'm working. Let's see, I feel it right here. I feel inner thighs. Who doesn't wanna work their inner thighs in their outer butt? Okay, you ready? So our jumping jacks, we're doing a lot of shoulder stuff, so make sure you move your shoulders all the way. Um, we're doing a lot of leg stuff, so warm those suckers up. All right, you ready, guys? We're going to go in 10 seconds. It's going to be quick 30 minutes. You're going to be like, what? That was it? Wow, I should work out more often. I know, me too. Okay, ready? Here we go. Jumping jacks is first. Here we go. And we're starting. So how's everyone's new year going? Oh, this is terrible, this lighting. Let's move. Move. Is that better? I'm really far away now. I'm so far away. How about this? Okay, let's try this again. Nothing. There we go. Is that better? So, what's new? How's everyone's year? <sighs> Ooh. You know when you get a headache and like when you jump, it makes it worse. <laughs> That's it's fun. Anyway, move your arms real wide. Jump your feet real wide. If you have issues with like your bladder control, just like 
Is this how you do it? I feel so silly. Okay, there. There we go. If you can't do a full jumping class, just do that. Great, 30 seconds done. Next, mountain climber. So, this again. Get on your mat. Just want to make sure you can see me. I still have my still have my booty band on. Again, that's creating a little bit of resistance. When you're doing mountain climbers, make sure your feet or hands are directly under your shoulders. You have flat back, tight core, and you're kicking your knees up and in. Some people like to tap here. That's fine. But if you can float, it's easier. If you live in an apartment, uh, don't do this. Unless you want to terrorize your downstairs neighbors. Uh, uh, here we go. Okay. Yeah, it's kind of hard to do this when you're fasting. Okay. There we go. Good. Next, we're going to stay on our, in a plank position. We're going to do shoulder tap jacks. Okay, come on. So this one. All right. Can you see? Okay, so you're in plank, right? What you're gonna do is you're gonna jump your feet out. Okay, so you can see me. Move this. Okay. Okay, I want you to see my whole thing. There. Okay, so jump your feet out. When you jump your feet out, tap your chest. So tap like heel, right? Shoulder with your left hand. There you go. So switch, switch, switch. Okay, 15 seconds. This takes a little bit of time to get used to. So don't be afraid to go slow at first. Three, two, one. Good. Next, we're going to get started in the work. So get your medium weight. We're going to be doing squat and press. I'm all warm. Okay. Medium weight. Squat press, I've got 15 pounds. So, feet shoulder distance apart. Squat down, press up. Squat down, press up. Now, if you can go 90 degrees, that'd be great. Because you get more out of your squat if you go 90 degrees. When you press up, oops. When you press up, Sorry. Make sure your core is engaged. Your butt is tucked under. You're not arching your back. And you're supporting your lower back too. One, good. Next, skaters. I just splattered. Skaters, so. Here's my son. Okay. So I mean, he might. Band on. What you're going to do is have a center point, reach with your opposite hand, jump, switch. If you still have your band on, it'll probably snap up. Well, that's fine. Anyway, so jump and switch. And what, you're doing, what we're doing here is in, including cardio with like a one-legged squat. And we're also twisting through the core. So we're working our core. Our obliques. Ooh, this is really great. Cardio and leg portion. Five, four, three, two, one. Good. Next. Then lift upright row. So grab your medium weights again. Oh. Okay, this one. Okay, feet together. Knees bent, but it's kind of tough. Oh, no. Stick your butt way out, way out, way out. So you're just hanging here. When you come up, make sure you tuck your butt. Shoulders back. Pull up the weights to your uh, chin. So again. Make sure your elbows are above your wrists. Back down. Now make one swimming motion. What I like to do when I'm first starting is pick a spot to pause. So. Pause, pause at the waist, pull up, pause here, waist, shins, waist, shoulders, waist. 
One more. Nice. Shoulders, waist. Down. Good. Next, to continue with the cardio and the legs, we're going to do in out squats. These are the worst. Here we go. Let's go on narrow. Just like that. We're not going to complicate it. Try to get low. Stay low. Because not only is this cardio, it's also strength. We're really working our quads right now. Our inner quads. Oh, our inner thighs. Because the booty band has extra resistance. It really helps. Oh, sorry. Straighten those muscles. And I'm really also feeling in the outer thighs. I know I'm stopping a lot, I'm sorry. Okay, can you see? Oh, God. If you're going past me, that's awesome. Get it done. All right, good. Next, bicep curl and press. I'm going to use my medium weights again. But if you're just starting out, you know, I might have to actually drop down to 10 pounds. I don't know. So in bicep curl, pin your elbows at your sides, curl up, and then we're going to press up all the way back down. Press up and make sure you pause at the top so you can check your form. Pause here. I don't want you stopping here. You want all the extension on your biceps. And now, breathe on the work. And now, make sure you're not swinging. Stop. Oh, two, one. Good. Next. Next. Switch lunge. So. You can take this off real quick. Switch lunge. This is the cardio again. So again, let's move forward. Lunge, jump, switch. If you can't jump, step up and pause. And pop those hips forward. Not really, just squeeze your butt. Okay, but I'm going to try to switch. There we go. Cardio strength, cardio strength. I'm about to. I'm gonna fan off screen and I'm gonna turn this bad boy on, am I right? I'm starting to sweat already. Like I said, I am fasting. So, this is actually quite difficult when you haven't eaten since last night. Here we go, fan next. Bent over row. So grab your medium weights. And just like in deadlift, you want to pop out your butt. Lean forward and pull up. Pinch your elbows at your sides. Act like you're pinching something between your shoulder blades. Gotta get my breath back, sorry. Pinch. Pinch. And the more you lean over, the less strain it is on your lower back. Make sure your back is flat, core is engaged. Pinch, pinch. Oh, gotta lean over more. Pinch, bend your knees. Pinch, two, one. Good. I put my gloves on. All right, next, weighted step up. So this is where you use my weight, my step on me. Oh, wasting time with these gloves. Okay, put the weight on your shoulders. Step up with right, down with right, up with left, down with left. Thank <laughs> you. 
and they're like, look so good and coordinated. Do you want to see how I do Zumba? My Zumba's like this, because I don't know what I'm doing. I am so uncoordinated. Incline shoulder press, okay. Incline shoulder press, this is where I'm going to use my ball. Eep. I'm going to put it against my step. We're wasting time, so I'm going to kind of work through the break here. So, ball is here. Can you see me? Yeah, kind of. So, lean back on the ball and press up. So, earlier we were doing a shoulder press while we were standing above our heads. That works one set of muscles. When you're inclined like this, you were kind of your chest shoulders, like the front of your shoulders. You know what I mean? So we're working that muscle right now. We're going to be working all the muscles in our upper body in a different and exciting way. Okay, three, two, one. Good. Let's see where the next one is. Here we go. Okay, um, mat or box jumps. Okay, so this one, this one, we're going to use our mat or our box, or you can use your mat. Hands on the bench, jump over. If you just have a mat, put your hand on the floor and just jump over. If you don't have a mat or a box, just use the floor. And jump across like a two feet span. You can put down like weights. 10 seconds. If you can't, do a one half single out. Just pulse. Okay? Otherwise, keep up. Good. Oh, next. Okay. Bent over shoulder press. So this one is a little challenging. You want light weight for this one. Okay. I'm gonna grab five pounds. So kind of like on the incline. I'm gonna wave the ball this time like this. It looks silly. Oh, oh I don't know if I can do this. Oh gosh. So I just have five pounds. Oh, I just press out. I would maybe go two and a half. Maybe just air. butt at all. So my butt, 
me demonstrate. Okay, when I'm up like this, I'm ball, my butt is up, my core is engaged the whole time. So it's more of a full body workout. Like I can feel my quads and my butt and my core right now because everything is flexed. Oof, okay. Next, oh, in out fast feet. So I'm gonna pause the time for a second because I'm gonna put my booty band back on. So who knows fast feet? If you ever played a sport, you know what fast feet is? I'm gonna switch this. This time, what we're gonna do, I paused my timer to fix a lot of things. And you know what? We're over halfway done. This is awesome. So with this one, start in the middle, okay? And what you're gonna be doing, you're gonna wanna practice this. Step out, step out, in, in. Out, in, in, out, oops, <laughs> see? Out, out, in, out. This is really hard to demonstrate. Out, 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 in, out, out. So now let's go fast, ready? Out, out, in, out, out, in, out, Okay, so we're gonna be doing that. Let's do it for 10 seconds, then I'll turn my timer back on. You ready? Who's here? Who's saying hi? My kids just dropped something upstairs. All right, ready? Say hi, Peter. I'd love to see you. Ready? Here we go. Out, out, in. Now you want to keep your feet low. Ooh, if it helps, like pretend you're holding something. Okay. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Start the timer. Here we go. 30 seconds. So if you get low, it's also kind of a squat. You can see what I mean. Oh. If you can't do this, like if this is too much coordination, just do fast feet. But if you want to work your outer glutes with the resistance band, you want to just extra challenge. Try out, out, in, and then you don't have to step far. Good, done. Next, narrow chest press. So, ball or bench? I'm gonna do bench, because it's easier. I'm gonna move it. So, with, whoops, the narrow bench. Ooh, keep your um, elbows pinched at your sides. And we're just doing a narrow press. So, you know, like normal chest press, your weights are facing forward and your elbows flare out. We're gonna be going in, right here. Again, it just hits the same muscle group, kind of in a different way. We're hitting our chest. I feel it a lot in my biceps. If you're on your ball, elevating a little bit, you can be working your butt and your core. Oh, this actually really hurts. That's pretty tough on the biceps. Next, uh, what's next? Where am I? Okay, jump squats. Okay, jump squats, pretty easy. I'm so thirsty. So, okay, yep, so kind of like, a little like jumping jacks, squat down, tip in the middle. With the booty band as resistance, I keep saying that, you can get them like Amazon, eight dollars right now there's a big um uh active what am i trying to say fitness related equipment on amazon pretty cheap because of new year's everyone wants to get in their new year's resolutions like me and you okay five four three two one good Next, chest fly. So I'm gonna use my medium weight again. How many people are watching? How many people say they're watching? Where are you actually watching? I'm not seeing anyone say hi. Don't be alive, don't be a weirdo, say hi. Okay, chest fly. So I'm gonna use 15 pounds again. Lay on your back. Okay, so hands left, knee in the center. You're gonna fly out, bend your elbows a little bit. Keep your elbows a little bit. 
made at the top. Make sure you breathe on the work. And make sure your core is engaged, your lower back. I'm going to show you. Your lower back is totally flat on the bench the whole time because you want to protect your lower back. You want to protect your abs. I would probably use like a 10 on this if I were just starting. Or a 5. 8. 15 is pretty intense. Good. Check slide. Plank jacks. You ready? I'm going to do it right. Uh, wasting time. Okay. Here. Can you see me? Okay. High plank. Jump your feet out. In. So you'll notice I still have my resistance bands on. I can't get in a good position. Shove. There. Out. In. Okay. There. Shoulders right above your hands again. might not look like much, oh. but after all the work we've been doing on our shoulders and the squats, it's, it's a lot. It's enough to get you. Two, one. Good. Next. Okay. Bent over fly. Grab a lighter weight. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to start with 10. See what happens. Okay. Next. So, if everyone were doing deadlift, and the rows, our back is flat. Stick your butt way out. Weight's me in the middle. Fly up. Fly up. Make sure you pick a weight that's challenging. That you're not just going through the motions, but it's actually difficult. Even though I dropped weight, so. I was on 15, and now I'm on 10. At first, I was like, oh, I can probably bump up. But right now, it's starting to hurt. Pinch your shoulders. Pinch your shoulders. Two, one. Good. Next. One. Burpee squats. Here we go. Burpee squats. So, I'm going to be where you can see me. So, you know, on burpee, you start here. Jump up, hold it here. Let's go. And hold the squat. Pick up that imaginary thing, or if you want a big challenge, oh, pick up an actual weight. Oh, I don't want that. I don't want that in my life. Just gonna do the squat. He's like, Lord. Have mercy, my butt hurts so bad. Oh, okay. Oh, go form. Last one. Oh, good. You doing this with me? Does your butt hurt? Okay, tricep dips. Grab your bench. There's room my bench. We got like six more minutes. I do. Okay. Grab your bench. Put your hands on your bench. Get up. Get down. Get up. And actually, I messed up first time. You want to keep your butt close to your bench because that'll add, whew, that gives more work in your triceps. Also, helps protect your abs. Make sure your core is engaged the whole time. Go slow and I'm like, Ugh. pass it out working. You could go all the way down and come up. But then when you go down, make sure your core is tight. And I kind of pause a little bit because I want to really make sure to protect my core. Um, next, bear kick through. Okay. Uh, I don't know if I can do this with my booty band, but I'm going to try. Okay, so you know what bear is, right? Your hands and knees, your knees are just hovering over the ground. What we're gonna do is plant left hand, switch over, kick out. You can't see me. Okay, okay, there we go. Kick, kick, and get back to 
center. Okay, there we go. Okay, make sure when you're kicking through, your core is engaged, your core is engaged here, your knees are hovering. When you're kicking your opposite foot to your opposite hand. Now you might think this doesn't look like much, but after everything we've done, my thighs are on fire. Okay, next, L push-ups. So, move on my stuff again. Whoa, hi! You scared me. Oh, it fell. Okay, so L push-ups. One hand is at your shoulder, other hand's up top. And then L. I can get on my knees. Why am I using the towel? Uh, because I kind of threw my yoga mat. It's everywhere. Make sure when you do the push-up, the elbow that's closest to you hugs your chest and your side. Okay. Okay. And uh, this is so much harder now. Okay. <laughs> so funny. So funny. Okay. Last one. You want to do this with me? Okay, these are wide squat hops. So take off your mat or your band because you can't have your band in the squat this far apart. So toes are pointed out, knees are pointed out. Get low, up, low, up. You like this? Down, up, down, up. If you don't have an extra 36 pounds on you, you're probably going much faster. But down, up. And you can probably hop a little bit higher. 10 seconds. Okay, here we go. Get down. Get down. Ah, my legs are broken. Ah, three, two, one. Okay, last one. No, don't, don't get up here. Next, around the world crunch. So Why grab like a towel. What? Why are you too I don't know. Can you see me? Okay, so knees are up at nine degrees, back is flat. So we're gonna go around the world. It's like a bicycle where you're bringing your knee, your weight to the opposite knee. Leave that alone, T. So crunch, crunch, crunch. Ow! 
Computer noises. That's what's happening. Almost done, guys. Almost done. Here we go. Make sure you bring your knees up. Bring your elbow to your knee. Two. I don't know. I'm just making that up. One. I can't see the time. Three. Two. One. We're done. Great work. Thanks for doing this with me. Oh, hold on, sorry. Okay. Thanks for doing this with me. I'm so glad you joined me. Uh, if you do this workout, let me know. Let me know what you think. Let me know what you want to see, and I will make it for you. All right. Good work, guys. Let's do this. See you later. Bye.